Hey, I'm Joel from Smash the Web, and today I'm going to show you how to set up Envato Elements template kits on WordPress. Let's smash it! G'day, uh, today we're going to install Envato Elements template kits on our WordPress site. Uh, now, to use Envato Elements template kits, you either need Elementor or Beaver Builder, and you'll need a WordPress install. So, whether that's on uh, your local computer, or on a hosting provider. So if you want to uh, get a refresher or learn how to install a site locally, like on your computer, your Windows or Mac computer, uh, check out my um, local by flywheel video. Um, I've got that down in the description and it runs through basically how to download it, how to install it and how to get started with, uh, with Elemental. All right, so let's jump in. So here we are in our fresh install of WordPress. I'm gonna to go to plugins. Let's add the plugin. So we'll just search for Envato Elements. I've already searched for it before. There we go. So install now. So essentially what this is, it's it's like a, um, a library of um, kits or templates, sorry, I should say, that you can download from the Envato um, website uh, and import into your your WordPress install. So it doesn't download every single template when you install the plugin, you pick and choose the ones you want to use. So to access the templates, you head over to the elements area. To activate the plugin, you need to pop in an email address and agree to the terms and conditions. Uh, you can choose to opt in to get uh, marketing emails from Envato about um, elements and new features that are coming and new template kits that have been released. I've already subscribed, so I won't subscribe again. Okay, so that gives us access now to all of the template kits. Up the top, we've got a couple of options. Um, we've got Elementor template kits and Elementor blocks. And there's also a photos, which is a coming soon, not too far away that integrates with Envato Elements um, on the Envato site. I'll just explain what that is. Oops, Envato Elements. So it's a subscription service that gives you access to uh, 1 million items. Um, so it, it, there's a wide range. So it's audio files, it's logos, it's videos, it's it's a whole bunch of stuff. Um, a lot of web related things as well. So for your sixteen dollars fifty US per month, uh, if you pay yearly, um, that you, you can download everything. So what um, the guys are doing is guys and girls are going to allow you to access photos. So rather than going to a stock website downloading them, you'll be able to use the photos um, within your WordPress or sorry, your Elementor uh, page builder or, you know, Beaver Builder page builder, whatever the case may be. Um, so that's coming really soon. Um, so look out for that. Anyway, that was a bit of a tangent. Uh, so back to here. So if you've got Beaver Builder installed, then you'll see a Beaver Builder tab. Uh, if you've got Elementor installed, then you'll see an Elementor tab, um, which is the one that we're working on. Uh, up in the top right hand corner, there's some updates as to what's been going on lately with the uh, with the template kits, and there's your activity, what you've downloaded, and, and your yeah your log of what you've been up to. Uh, right, so then you have the enviable task of choosing a template. So um, I'm assuming you've come here with some kind of uh, purpose in mind. You want to design a website for a specific specific um, niche. Uh, so you can use this filter up here to um, drill down. So um, let's go creative and design. Oh, very nice. So we've got some interior decorating, um, arts festivals, all sorts of stuff. So to review the templates, you can scroll across, you'll get a quick thumbnail view. And then if you want to see what the full page looks like, just hover over one of the templates or one of the thumbnails, I should say, and you'll be able to see the full template. Um, any templates that use any of the pro features of Elementor will have a little pro sticker here. So you'll know if you're only using the free version of Elementor, then uh, you won't be able to use some of the f some of the features in that particular template. You can still download it, install it. It's just if you don't have pro, you may not be able to use a contact form or 
um, one of the other pro features. You can replace those with other um, solutions. So for a contact form, you could use contact form seven, which is free. So there's ways around it, but it's just letting you know that some of the elemental features won't be available. Okay. Uh, oh, I should um, put in a little um, shout out. If you need to buy pro, if you're uh, on the fence as to whether to dive in and um, get started with Elemental Pro. I've got a link down in the description, which will, uh, it's an affiliate link, so it'll give me a little bit of money back uh, from each sale that's um, that's made via that link. Uh, and that'll really help me out and help me keep doing uh, the videos and support the channel. Um, and I, I highly recommend getting Pro, even, I'm, even though it sounds like I'm biased. Um, it, Elemental has really changed my my workflow, my, my web development life. Um, I used to do I used to do development. It was very manual. I would, I would hate it. I would design it. I would, um, that, that was my favorite part being the creative person that I am. I would do the creative side of things and then it'd come to code it and I'd have to do all this custom PHP stuff and CSS and it was just laborious and painful. So Elemental came along two and a half years ago, maybe three nearly. Um, and I gave it a try. Um, I was, pretty against page builders. I'd used other page builders in the past and they were terrible. Um, really, really bad. Um, so I gave Elementor a go and it was like a breath of fresh air. It was amazing. So um, Pro just makes life that much easier as well. So even the free version of Elementor is, is wonderful. Pro will just make, make it twice as good. Um, so anyway, that's another tangent. Uh, let's get stuck in. So I really like this interior design one. So I'm going to click on here, have a bit of a better view of the thumbnail. Yep, that looks nice. All right, so I'm going to, so from here you can make two choices. You can either import it as a template and it'll sit in your My Templates library in Elementor, uh, or you can create a page straight away. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'll put in a title there, create a new page. So that will grab the uh, JSON file, which is how Elementor exports its settings and grab all the images as well from the Envato servers. And that's done. So we can then add more pages uh, to the site or download more templates. Uh, but for now, that's enough for me. So I'll just go to pages now and we can see we've got a new home page with the status of draft. Click on edit with Elementor. And there we go. So we can see that is ready to roll. That's a really good looking template. Cool. That was quick and painless. Um, oh, I should mention it's all free. So there's no need to have an Envato Elements subscription at all. Uh, all these templates are free. Um, the only benefits you might get in the future is the photos integration. Um, that's the only reason you might need to create an Envato Elements subscription. But for now, you're free to use these for free, um, use them for client projects. That's pretty much it. So if you like the look of that and you want to learn more about it, you can jump onto the Envato Elements uh, website. Uh, you can download the plugin and read the, the readme. You can leave a comment below and ask any questions. Um, I'm happy to answer those. And if I can't answer them, I'll refer them on to the team at Envato that are working on it um, and that's it so if you like the video please hit the like button uh, if you want to see more of these kinds of videos in the future I'm actually going to do a, a series on redesigning one of my clients websites um, using some of the templates from Envato Elements uh, and then yeah customizing it and um, and rebuilding it in a more modern way so if you want to see those uh, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell if you want to be notified when I've released new videos Okay, that's it for now. Cheers.